We now know how to draw an enlargement or reduction given a scale factor. But what if we don't know what the scale factor is? We can find the scale factor by comparing the original image to the scale model. For example, take this shape. The original is on the left, and a reduction is on the right. We want to compare similar sides of the two shapes to find out how much it's been reduced by. Let's take this side of the original. It is four units long. When we look at the corresponding side of the reduction, we can see that it's two units long. Remember the formula for scale factor that we looked at a couple videos ago? Well, now we're going to get some use out of it. Here it is again. Scale factor, or SF, equals size of the model divided by the size of the original. So, if a side length in our model is two units long, and the same side in the original is four units long, we get two divided by four, which reduces to one half. So, we have a scale factor of one half. We could use any side of the object to do this calculation. For example, we could look at this side instead. It's two units long in the original and one unit long in the model. By plugging those numbers into our formula, we get one half again. Let's try another example. What is the scale factor that was used to enlarge this shape? Why don't you try this one out yourself? and unpause the video when you're finished. You could have picked any side of the triangle to compare, but I'm going to choose this one. It's four units long in the original and 12 units long in the model. We put those into our handy dandy formula and get 12 divided by four, which is three. So the scale factor for this enlargement is three. Finding the scale factor by looking at the original and scale model of an object is pretty easy. All we have to do is compare the lengths of similar or corresponding sides of the objects by plugging them into the scale factor formula. By seeing how much one side of the object has been enlarged or reduced by, we know it must be the scale factor because all sides have to have been scaled by the same amount or else they are not proportional, and therefore not even a scale model.